Alright guys, I've got Zane Trick and Rebug here. This helicopter just dropped off at the harbor. Loud. As you can see on the map, there's a little crate there for the harbor. Uh, let's, here, I'll zoom in. There you go. You see the crate? Oh, two have dropped off here. There is two crates. Oh, drop. All right, let's do this, guys. I'm working up. I'm working up. He's flying away. He'll circle back. Did somebody shoot a rocket? Yep. Is that a... Is that a... No? Okay, I thought I was going to track it. No. Heat seeking would be nice. But a little bit OP, I think. Did it is it actually just flying away? Yep. It is. Looks like it. Alright, well we need to find the crate. Where is the crate? It's back this way. Found the crate. I'm still trying to scale the mountain. There we go. Ooh. Nice. So with this thing, you can actually uh, repeatedly shoot the thing to start it over, which would suck. But it takes 15 minutes to hack, and you've got to protect this thing for 15 minutes. It resets to 15 minutes every time it gets shot. So as you can see, Repug is beautifully demonstrating there. So That's I just... guess uh, we will be back. Once 15 minutes have gone by? Roger that. All right, so, so we've got both of these boxes are open. As you guys can see, the loot's pretty decent. I got a double armor door, which is pretty rare to find. We got bolt action, some heavy armor. I mean, sorry, a uh, metal face mask and uh, a python and a decent amount of pipes. And then over here, the other one has got actually even better loot. Uh, in here, we've got a hollow sight. Heavy chest piece, some tech trash, some high qual rocket launcher, a muzzle brake, and a metal chest piece. So, I mean, if you can get one of these, you can be pretty set on some blueprint learning uh, if you can fight off the other people coming to the gigantic locked crate symbol on the map. So that's definitely really cool. Uh, what we're going to do right now is we, I guess there can only be so many of the helicopters on the server. So we're trying to eradicate the ones that are around and we're going to spawn one in and try fighting it. We did find out you can shoot it down. So we will be back for that. All right, uh, we kind of got one stuck. So I'm going to go ahead and uh, yeah. As you can see, explosive ammo definitely does damage uh, around like 400 to 450 or so shots of actual hits seem to be doing it. And I just did that in less than two clips, so maybe not. I don't know, it just depends on how well you directly hit them. Uh, but there you go, guys. Uh, it does blow up. When it blows up, it drops its crate. And I see another one coming in. I wonder if I can get its attention. Oh, it definitely got its attention. But it's got its own thing. But yeah, pretty much, guys, this event is just, uh, you know, it's not really meant to take this thing down like the other helicopter. This one's meant to just kind of drop off its loot, and the event is you protecting that loot while it hacks. So this is definitely going to be a really awesome event. Uh, it's not 100% done, so do expect to see some changes and optimizations to it. But I don't know about you guys, I'm very excited to see it in-game. So go check it out, guys, and uh, go give the uh, Rust devs some props on how they're doing. While well, I get shot at by my friend from across the way. But anyways, guys, thanks for watching, and we will see you next time.